When I think about how it was back at the beginning, the whole story goes a long way back, doesn't it? It was difficult, the tears in my Achilles tendon. They gave me the most trouble at the time. But we know now that because of the extreme tension in the muscles in my back, when I sat in the sled again to work on pressure levers for my legs, that's when I suddenly heard it go crack. And unfortunately then the vertebrae were out. That was the problem. Basically, I had surgery almost every other year. I had seven operations on my lumbar vertebrae. Unfortunately, the final operation was another kick in the gut. Because during that one, it really was the very last one I was having done, they accidentally cut a nerve in my front leg muscle. They weren't able to get it back to how it was before. That was really unfortunate, of course, because as a former athlete, I really couldn't stand it. The first years were so hard for me to take that I actually... I actually didn't care what happened. I really didn't want anything anymore. By losing sport, I lost the best and greatest thing in my life. During those really difficult years, this orthosis, at least, gave me back a lot of my courage and contentment. At the end of the day, it was an orthosis that had developed in such a way that I couldn't even believe the possibilities it suddenly gave me. The EMAG active had gained such advantage over every other orthosis. It was important for me to be able to do even more, because my leg, my right leg, was gone, after all. For me, it's about being able to go on a walk with my wife now and again. I can even go on walks in the forest, going out with my wife here and there, going shopping together, or that we can even go on trips. The feeling of being able to travel like anyone else can. When all is said and done, achieving this kind of contentment, where you can say, I am happy as a person, I can go on walks with my grandchildren, they wear me out, of course, too, and I'm tired in the evening. But that's not what matters. Rather, I'm able to say, good, I've got my grandchildren around me, and I'm able to play with them. I'm able to do things with them. I can't really think of anything I can't do that isn't possible anymore. We've got a caravan, for example, and we take the caravan on holiday at least three or four times a year. I think we've come through it all so well that we can be happy now, even if there have been some tears.